Hello, everyone. I'd just like to confirm just before we begin that everybody can hear me well and that I'm uh, clear. Can I just get a thumbs up or just uh, an OK for confirmation on that, please? OK, thank you for the confirmation there. <clears throat> so my name is Bilal Naeem, and I am a Yearlink product manager at Electronic Frontier. I'd like to thank each of you for taking out time to participate in today's webinar. And alongside me is my marketing colleague, Asha. Hi, this is Asha. And he will be taking care of the uh, sales and EFL promotions that uh, we will be discussing today. And I will cover the sort of technical presentation and the overview of the uh, products we will be discussing in today's webinar. Okay, this session will focus on the following. The WAT decked IP multi-cell system, the new W59R ruggedized handset, the Yealink conferencing solution, and finally the uh, portable speakerphone. So that's on my side. And of course, my colleague will also be covering the special offers from Electronic Frontier. Okay, just to begin with, uh, so this is a general overview of the Yealink decked portfolio, covering a range of different deployments in place. So this includes the CP930W, the portable speakerphone, the W41P, which includes a T41S desk phone, the W60 base station, and finally the multi-cell offering. I'm also pleased to announce the introduction of the W59R, a ruggedized offering suited for warehouse and industrial sites. More on this later in this presentation. So we will now look into and discuss the multi-cell offering by Yealink in a little more detail. So key features for the W80DM and W80B. So to begin with, the W80DM is of course the deck manager so that uh, will of course take care of the uh, the large proportion of operations for for a multi cell system so the seamless handover the roaming the capacity is up to 30 base stations up to 100 parallel calls up to 100 handsets and of course up to 100 sip accounts and of course the dimensions and the color that it's available in the W80B, which is the base station in this uh, case, is a competitive and stable signal strength and coverage, uh, the capacity of eight active handsets and eight simultaneous calls for a narrowband codec, and four active handsets and eight simultaneous calls for a wideband codec. 50 meter indoor and 300 meter outdoor, and of course the dimensions and uh, color it's available in. So the difference, key differences between the W80DM and W80B, the W80DM st standing for Decked Manager works as purely as a Decked Manager to manage base synchronization, SIP accounts and handsets, call control, and finally allocate system resources. The W80B main purpose is to work purely as a base station to transfer media media traffic like uh, an antenna, for example. So both the W80DM and the W80B can be upgraded to each other by firmware change. Uh, the hardware is, is effectively the same. So uh, just to sort of summarize a, uh, a very basic uh, topology and overview, a visual representation on how a basic multi-cell system is configured. And as you can see, the primary base station in this case, the W80DM maintains base synchronization, SIP accounts, call control, and system resource. And the W80B, as previously indicated, works purely as a base station to transfer media traffic. So I am also delighted to announce uh, additional support for the W41P, and CP930W conference phone, and of course the new W59R. 
So key features of the WA2B include seamless roaming and stability, easy setup and deployment, excellent user experience, and finally troubleshooting. We will, of course, touch into each of these in a little more detail. Okay, so the seamless roaming and stability, um, which effectively allows users to, to roam freely and in large indoor and outdoor areas with a very fast uh, and responsive 20 millisecond handover. A very competitive signal coverage recently increased by about 15 dBm to further improve the uh, signal strength. And uh, finally, the stability to ensure the multi-cell system is continuously in operation at all times. Uh, the Easy Deployment Kit, um, I am happy to announce, in addition to their uh, DECT offering, Yealink also provide a deployment kit to help partners execute site surveys. And as per this slide, the package contents are listed below, just to give you uh, a visual overview on what you can expect. We will, of course, provide a little more information on the package contents if there is of any interest. If for any reason uh, you don't decide to use the deployment kit, either the W53H or the W56H support what's known as measuring mode to help measure signal and voice quality. For medium and large deployments, however, Yealink recommends purchasing the deployment kit. So excellent user experience. Uh, as per the screenshots, uh, multiple directories supports for all users. Uh, easy pairing handset with or without uh, a pin code, a quick contact pairing while dialing, and of course the HD color screen and intuitive menu. So with the latest version of firmware, Yealink have also implemented important enhancements on troubleshooting. For instance, the entire system can now be viewed via the web GUI. For example, if a customer informs you a particular handset is not roaming, or for example, call quality is not to the expectation uh, of your customer, you can now log into the web interface to confirm uh, connectivity and signal levels. The system statistics module allows you to analyze the performance levels. For example, if any base station has a busy path uh, resulting in large number of calls not establishing, uh, you will need to effectively consider whether it's appropriate to, to add another base station in that area. And if the issues continue persi to persist, uh, you can generate troubleshooting files, and Yelink have simplified this in the sense that all base diagnostics feature allows you to export the PCAP, syslog, and config file on all bases with one click. So uh, just a pricing comparison here, uh, a very brief overview. So based on a standard trade price, the Yealink multi-cell system uh, is more cost-effective when compared to other uh, vendors such as Snom or uh, Gigset, irrespective of uh, how many base stations are factored in. I am pleased to announce the new Yealink WR59, which is now readily available. A recognized uh, decked handset certified to IP67, dust, shock, and water resistant. In addition to this, uh, it also supports a Bluetooth alarm functionality and of course the uh, belt clip that you, uh, that you, I guess in most cases need. Uh, why would you need one? Um, in places uh, exposed to humidity and dust, uh, users who have a high requirement for the handset capability of dust, water, and shock resistance. So warehouses uh, is, is, a, is a good example of where you may need one. And of course, it works in a multi-cell system, so for, for wider free movement. So the physical appearance, physical appearance and structure, sorry, of the W59R. So most noticeably, uh, a 1.8 inch uh, TFT uh, color screen, the stable uh, spring press clip, a ruggedized service to protect uh, handsets from slipping, scratching, and disinfectant, 
uh, of course, the no noise cancelling uh, aspect, the alarm button, the uh, built-in 1460 milliamp lithium ion battery with a few uh, specifications on what it provides. For example, a quick charge, a quick 10 minute charge would give you two hours uh, usage. And of course, the, the weight, color and the deck range on your right there. So I, I am pleased to confirm the W59R is fully compatible with the multi-cell and single-cell offering by Yealink. In addition to this, it can also work with the T5 series as a corded cordless phone. Mind you, there that uh, is still pending and it's likely um, available in the next uh, official firmware release. So the basic features uh, for this device are listed to your right ranging from three-way conference, voicemail, speed dial, redial, so on and so forth. Uh, key features, once again, certified ingress protection ratings of 67, a professional sound, vibration capabilities, the spring press belt clip, and of course, the alarm functionality. And of course, the uh, large keypads to provide raised buttons with spaces between them, making the handset easier to, to use whilst wearing gloves, for example, as you can see. Easy adjustment of uh, call volume, handy in areas such as construction sites, warehouses, etc. And of course, the uh, marketing uh, position for the W59R, as you can see, it's very well balanced in terms of price and of course, performance, sitting in the middle of um, equivalent models uh, from uh, Gigaset and of course the uh, Snom 85. So a very, very competitive product for, for what it offers. Okay, we will uh, now move on to uh, introducing the Yealink speakerphones. Okay, the physical appearance of uh, both devices, the CP700 to your right, ideal for one to three people, and the usage includes personal use, private space, and effectively on the go. And the CP900 to your left here is ideal for up to six people, and of course, personal use, huddle rooms, and on the go. So just some examples of uh, usage. Of course, you've got the private office, uh, the small meeting room, which probably would uh, be more factored towards the CP900 and uh, on the go business. So if you have any meetings at the airport or as a business um, premises, it's uh, very ideal for that sort of scenario as well. A uh, lightweight design, compact and small, and the protective zipper bag, which is also bundled uh, with the CP700 and CP900 when uh, you purchase it, of course. And just some product characteristics, including noise-proof technology, full duplex experience, a six microphone beamform array, the CP700 has two microphones, a 360 degree voice pickup, and of course, the dynamic EQ for music and meetings, or of course, calls. Okay, intuitive function keys, very easy to see, uh, easy to press, easy to visually experience, and uh, of course, a very uh, friendly user experience. Okay, uh, multiple connectivity options uh, in terms of a Bluetooth connectivity or via USB. Up to two sorry, up to two simultaneous connections, and of course a long press answer key to, to switch between audio channels. So a handy feature if, uh, for example, your laptop or tablet or mobile phone in this case doesn't support uh, Bluetooth, for example. Excellent battery life and uh, a very handy feature in terms of the LED light ring power indicating indicator. Sorry. On your left, uh, you can see a full battery, a medium battery, and of course, uh, a low battery, just a visual uh, representation on uh, when you think you may need to charge it. And of course, the, the charging time, the talk time, the standby time on your right for, uh, for each model there. Uh, 
Okay, and um, so we are going to uh, have a brief discussion about the, the off uh, audio conference phones uh, that Yealing have on offer. And whilst they, they have been around for uh, readily available, mind you, for, for some time now, we will briefly uh, recap the models uh, available. So just to summarize here, we've got the, the Yealing CP960 to your left. This is the enterprise device for medium to large size meetings. The CP9 20 to your right there is a mid-range device for small to medium-sized meetings. And of course, the, the CP930W, which is a wireless decked offering. So this is suited for wireless meetings um, where, of course, you don't have uh, any cabling in place. So this particular model that you see here is bundled with a W60B base station uh, by default. So key features include premium audio experience, a 20-foot microphone pickup, easy control and operation, and of course, a very handy built-in Bluetooth Wi-Fi and of course, uh, USB support for, for things like uh, local USB recording or, or recovery and uh, a broad interoperability with multiple uh, platforms and PBXs. So the design and technology, so the noise proof technology includes two interrelated functions. The first function reduces contact background noise from sources, sources such as typing, air conditions, etc. And of course, the second function on these conference phones will automatically mute mics until the sound of a human voice is detected. Just a, a visual representation and uh, some of the features involving a wireless microphone pairing via USB, pairing via Bluetooth, call recording, and the external loudspeaker connectivity, and some of the features there that you see uh, to your left. And of course, the same with the CP920, we have uh, a number of features, uh, key features to your left there, and uh, just to sort of summarize, the superior audio quality, the PSDN and SIP interoperability with the CPN10, the built-in Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, the local three-way PSTN conference, and of course, uh, the call recording. And just to, to finally elaborate on the CP930W, so this is the DECT offering, uh, which encompasses the built-in battery, the DECT technology, the five-way conference uh, call capability, the HD audio pairing via USB and Bluetooth, and of course, call recording and hybrid UC meeting. So you will have some additional settings there and features there to your left uh, for you to view. Okay, I will uh, I'll now hand over to uh, my colleague Asha. Apologies for the uh, interruption on uh, the uh, sound there. For some for some reason, we're not sure why that uh, that seemed to be affecting some and and not others. So apologies for that. So I'll just hand you over back to my colleague now. Thank you. Thank you again, and I do apologize as well for the issues with, with the microphone. Um, so um, going back to um, the NFR offers that we um, discussed on our last webinar, um, we've had um, a range of offers. Um, some of them are um, sort of ending the end of September. Um, they are the T31P, T33P, as well as the two portable speakers, the CP900 and the CP700. However, I am very happy to um, announce that um, EFL and Yaling, we've worked together to extend um, the NFR offering on um, a, a range of our products that have been um, extremely popular with um, uh, with the network of resellers and the end users alike. Um, so our T30P, T31G, and T33G um, handsets, they are the, um, the, the sort of the new lineup that has been introduced um, very recently this quarter. Uh, they are continuing till the end of um, 2020, 65% um, off of um, RRP um, for the NFR. They are still maximum one piece each model. So um, just to clarify on that, I've had a few questions on that. Um, when we say each model, it means that you, as a, as a reseller, you can get one T30P, one T31G, and one T33G. It's not one of the whole of T30 series. Um, 
Again, this is the case with our um, headsets, the UH36, both mono and dual. Um, it is 65% off until the end of 2020. Um, we are running, we're still running the NFR offer on our uh, W80DM and W80B. Both are the same price. Um, the extended date is end of November 2020, and um, the ruggedized handset has been um, extended till the end of 2020. Again, um, one piece each model, again, going back to the W80DM and W80B, you can have one of each um, to sort of test it out for yourself. Um, again, if you're looking to benefit from that, please get in touch with um, sales, either by emailing us at sales at electron.com or getting in touch with your account manager who um, would be more than happy to assist you. Um, the Yaling project support is still going on. However, the 4% the extra, which is 1% um, for the specific industry, mainly those industries that have been sort of known to be crucial, i.e. education um, and um, sort of in the UK would be NHS, any um, sort of uh, doctors and uh, what have you, plus the 3% extra where you have um, over 50% of T5 series products. However, your standard one to two, one to four percent um, discount is still ongoing to um, twenty sort of the end of twenty twenty, the thirty first of December. And lastly, um, our upgrade program, the T, uh, the upgrade to T fifty four W from T forty six S, which has been um, so very popular, has to unfortunately end end of this month. But please stay tuned because um, sort of I'm continuously working with our sales team and with Yaling to offer you guys more products and sort of, um, you know, assist you in winning more, uh, more projects. And that's it for our webinar today. Thank you very much for attending. And if you do have uh, any questions, we'll be, we'll be happy to, to answer them for you now. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, there has been no questions, so um, hopefully we've done our jobs very well. Thank you very much for attending and have a lovely rest of the day.